That's about it. Not really expecting much of anything. In fact, Stormcast is going to be really quiet. Just some clouds and then some clear skies. This is Tuesday morning at 6 a.m. Uh, we'll see the clouds try to come back and then go away and then come back. And it's just really one of those uh, setups where there's not a whole lot going on. Nothing to really spark any showers or thunderstorms or snow or anything like that. It's just a very quiet, quiet forecast. Might see a little, looks like a little patchy fog uh, as we head through early Tuesday and then partly cloudy skies uh, Tuesday afternoon into the evening hours. But again, no precipitation. In fact, this is going to zoom all the way through one week. And this is how much rainfall is expected. Through that, this is all the way through next Monday. So seven days and we're not even five one hundredths of an inch, maybe over here between O'Neill and Valentine, maybe a tenth of an inch. But models change. That's why we continue to look at them day after day. Uh, but right now, this is looking like a very dry seven to ten days ahead. Forecast for tonight, temperatures dropping to around 40, which you may think, well, that's a little on the cool side, right? We should be closer to 30 this time of year. So it's definitely a very mild uh, evening, partly cloudy skies, 41 degrees early tomorrow morning. A very light south wind at 5 to 10 miles per hour. I think we'll do uh, similar to what we had today again tomorrow, maybe just a touch cooler. We're looking at 68 degrees for Lincoln, Seward and York, uh, closer to 70 in Beatrice at 69, some 71s in Fairbury, Heber and Hastings and Kearney at 71, 73 in Grand Island. But uh, 68 in the capital city, partly cloudy. We should be around 56, so a good uh, 10 to 12 degrees warmer than average. South wind at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Normally I'd say don't get used to this because it's November for goodness sakes, but you know, it looks like it might as well get used to it for a little while. Middle 50s though, a little bit cooler Thursday, Friday. So closer to normal as we get through the second half of the week and into the weekend. Boy, that Husker game, that's a great football day right there. 55 degrees, partly cloudy skies, and then we warm right back up. Can you believe that? Middle, lower and middle 60s as we head through early next week. So uh, it doesn't look like the other shoe is going to drop anytime soon. We are going to remain at or above average for quite a while. And while things can change as, uh, models, new models come in. We may add a chance for rain here and there, but for now, this looks like a really dry 10-day forecast. Yeah, very calm. Mm -hmm. Not much change in the temperatures or much. And yeah, that recent beautiful. cold streak we had, that's just a distant memory now, right? I don't remember it all. <laughs> what are you talking about, Rodney? <laughs> Thank you, Rusty. Hey, before we show you today's stock report, here's